Okay. Hello, hello. Hello, 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 hello. Hi, Hi. whoever is waiting, thank you. <laughs> good evening for you, good evening for us. Er, good evening for us. Good, e good evening. How are you on this beautiful evening? Actually, I don't know if it's beautiful. Is it cold? I heard it's getting really cold in the States. It's really cold here, but then, you know, weather. Okay, today we're making pan fried bread. We're basically making like a, it's just the most simple bread you can make. Flour, yeast, butter, sugar, mm -hmm. dough. Like that's the yeah. most simple thing you can make, but. The interesting thing is we don't have an oven here in Korea. So we have found a way to make bread uh, on the stove. Yeah. That's pretty interesting. Yeah. <laughs> People have been doing that for centuries, but you know, we're not recreating the wheel here. Yeah. So can... let's see. You got the okay. recipe? Oh yeah. We'll get started. Actually, let's let a couple more okay. people come. Uh we'll give it a couple minutes here. I'm gonna pour myself some coffee. Hey Marie. Hey Marie. Why is that coming up so small? Hey, Good, really morning to Marie. What, three in the morning? Good morning. Thank you for staying up to see us. We love you. One a.m., babe. Oh, what? My mom says. Just got home from work, running late, but I'm here. Hey, Hi, Mom. Okay. How was work? How was work? Did everything go well? Were people, did you get beat up? I know that happens on the usual there. Guten Morgen. Did I get it right? I think that's right. I remember I had a friend who was German. He was like half German. He was obsessed with saying German words. And that was one of them. All right. You ready? We have yeah. a... Simple, simple recipe for you, Mom. Yeah, this one's... And fried bread. You've never made bread, though, so you can benefit and see how easy this is. Oh, do you want to grab a cup? A roll. We don't have a rolling <laughs> pin, though, so we're going to use a cup. Don't Real hate. Shit. This is all we have. I don't want to buy one, so this is what you get. You get a plastic so cup for our rolling pin. All right, so let's... We need... Let's start with the yeast. Yeah, we need to... So what? how much water? Uh, let's put the yeast in its own cup. Can I just put yeast in here? Uh, no, that's all right. Here, I'll pull. It needs one cup of warm water. I think you can just put it in there because then you just add everything to it. Yeah, but then we have to wait 10 minutes. We can. Yeah, yeah, we should anyway. Okay, okay. Yeah. Okay, one cup of warm water. One cup. Oh, we, I am well. Um, just getting over this really cold weather in the negative Fahrenheit here, so. What did that tell you? I don't, know. I don't know, but it was really cold. Trying to get over the cold. Uh, we went out yesterday, finally. COVID is looking better in Korea right now. So we finally went out. Uh, we tried to go to uh, a botanical garden, but they seem to be closed, unfortunately, even though their website said they're open all year long. We looked inside and we saw palm trees and a bunch of plants, but. They, they, we weren't allowed in. And then, what, where's our yeast? Yeast. Yeah. Oh, sugar first. Sugar, teaspoon of white sugar. Teaspoon. Uh, we got to feed that yeast. Feed the yeast. A teaspoon, that's like one third of a tablespoon. All right. Yes. I don't know. I just. Correct the moon dough. We've got enough baking now. Looks blurry. Blurry? I think it's uh, in focus now. Does that look about a third? Maybe a little too much. Is that better? Is yeah, that about a third? Weird, yeah. Boom. Okay. Now put your yeast in. Put your yeast in, you know, get the yeast starting. You need a, some scissors. Yeah. A scissors. A scissor. A scissors. Because a scissors is one item. Right? I always say that's wrong. It is wrong. <laughs> You're trying to think. Oh, I don't care. 
One way. That's not how it works. Grammar. Okay, and you make sure you stop because you gotta feed your yeast. Feed the yeast. And it has to. Mm, it smells like newt. <laughs> Is that better, Mom? The camera? Does everything look good now? Did you touch? Did you share on your okay, parents? Mm -hmm. I mean, I just shared, so let's see what they do. But we went to, um, what was that? Oh, the, you hit that, yeah. Uh, yeah. We went to Pyongyang, which is uh, actually has a military base in here in Korea. So there's a lot of English stuff and a lot of cool stuff to do in Pyongyang. So we went to a market, and uh, it was the biggest market I've ever seen. It was, oh my god! It was outside, it was but it was like a huge open building where like each side was open. Oh my god! And there was anything you want in Korea, you can get. Well, like food wise, at least. Oh my god! And clothing wise, they had. Like, yeah, we filmed a video there, like Erica was saying, but they had full, like, pig heads just sitting out. They oh. had this, they had, so they butchered this whole cow, and they had the cow's skull, like, sitting at the front of this one butcher yeah. stand. Oh, my God. It like, was ridiculous. It's eye, but it wasn't just the skull, though. That's the thing. It was a skull with skin and eyes and, like, teeth still. Like, it still, yeah, had, it still had skin. Some flesh yeah, it still it. had some skin. It was so fucking gross. And then they had these... Like you said, the pig heads, but the pig heads weren't just like, they were like full ass ear. Like, it looked like you just took a pig and just chopped the head off completely. Yeah, can't wait to see the video. It was oh, it's so, crazy. Yeah, it was crazy. It was so big. And, and I had to use the bathroom so bad, and David had to. So we finally found like a, a public bathroom, but it said male and female. And I walk in, and there's urinals, and I just see three dicks right away. I'm like, all right, well, this is just making me really out. uncomfortable. I'm definitely not going in there. And I didn't see any women in it, so I was like, is it men and women? But there was a men and women's sign on there. I'm yeah. like, fuck, I just wait. So I found a one later on that was the same, but there was nobody in it. So I was like, okay, I can go. It was traumatizing. I'm yeah, sure. it was it was it was Saturday though, and it wasn't like crazy busy like I thought it was gonna be. It was busy, yeah. but not like the one that we went to and uh Asan. Asan. Yeah, that one was like person to person, just in a in a fi single file yeah. line, just stuck. My mom says hi. Ah! Hi, Marie's mom. Hi, Marie's mom. We love you. Your daughter is amazing. We're just waiting for our yeast to eat the sugar. Can you see? We're committing oh. science experiments here. Um, but also, we found this store. I, we passed it and it said World Food. And I was like, oh, yeah. World Food? But they didn't really have any American food. It was mostly <laughs> like uh, like, a, like like other Western parts of Asia. Western Asia and like Eastern yeah. Europe. Like a lot of Indonesian food and... And I don't know, but everyone in there was not Korean. Like all of them looked like different Asian. Yeah, Western, background. Eastern, yeah, Eastern, Middle Eastern. Like, yeah. yeah. But it was cool. We got some uh, Indonesian ramen noodles, and uh, what else we get? We got some Chinese tofu snacks. Yeah, we got some uh, Chinese pecan flavored sunflower seeds. Yeah, pecan flavored sunflower seeds. Those are pretty interesting. And I tried one, and I just ate the whole thing. It tastes like a freaking sausage. Yeah. You both look amazing. We just woke up. We got that morning glow. We got that makeup glow. My eyes are swollen, of course, you know. I'm half asleep. I did the dishes. They were piling up all weekend. I did dishes for like 45 minutes straight, so I'm hurting right now. How are we looking? Get some bubbles going. Yep, a little bit. This is enough bubbling, really. You want maybe she a couple She said hi, sweet. sweeties. Hey, no, Mom. we have a couple. We have like one more minute. Let's just wait. Yeah, we'll let this sit for like maybe How two or three more minutes. Live? We've only been live for nine minutes, so we started at it. like four minutes. Yeah, it's been like five minutes. So, but, but yeah. yeah, just uh, <laughs> do we not? We probably don't need another update. Yeah, Mom, we're making uh, the bread. We talked about it last week. Uh, we might, you know, we're like, well, we might make the bread. We want to make a dessert, but it was kind of hard for us to find like the stuff we needed to make our. Like red bean shaved ice dessert that we know. Um, so we're gonna do this. This is obviously what we're doing this week, and then yeah. next week we're gonna try to do something maybe a little more exciting. Oh, we should show them the little puffs that we got from the market. They're right up there. This is yeah. This is something we got from the market. It's like these snacks. This is super common. This kind of snack. 
They taste like puffed cereal, like, I don't know. They they have the texture of like, what was I saying? Like a puff, like a Cheetos puffed puff. Rice. Or yeah, like a Cheetos puff or like a puffed rice cake. And then they're like sweet and like slightly cinnamony, slightly brown sugar. Honestly, to me, mom, listen, it tastes like your powdered creamer on top of that. That's what it tastes oh, like to me. Or like prop, but yeah, so this is what they, the typical, what they look like. They're huge bags. We, I was asking her, I said, I said, small bag. Have small bag. <laughs> and then she and she didn't understand, so I did that because that's how I do it with my students. And then they understand. She's like, oh no! And then opened it and like made us try it. She's like, she's you're like, gonna like this. <laughs> yeah, because she's like, well, I don't have small bags, but I can make you buy this big bag. Yeah, she did. And she and did then, good. Yeah, we also we bought um, almonds for the first time in forever. They were we got we like, got a kilogram of almonds for like twelve bucks. Yeah, so it's like two point two pounds. Yeah, what's all that's right? A big old bag. Yeah, we can get the rest flour. going. All right, two and a half cups of flour. Our yeast is starting to activate. Where's the oh. flat? Oh, the cup right there. Okay. Oh, it only dried out real quick. No, it's fine. It's no, fine. you shouldn't have. One. He hates I me. I tell ya. I tell ya. But yeah, I want to go back to that market and actually do our grocery shopping there. Yeah. I think that would. That would be really interesting. I should not have packed that. That's okay. Here you. I'm fucking making this. That's how it's done. Wait, well, I guess we're going to use this flour. What? One more. It's two and a half, so that's one. Two and a half? Yeah. Wow, that's a big one. Maybe do a, don't do the half because I think that was a lot, like a more. Oh. Well, let's just mix it. In Here, I'm going to do this. The, I'm going to pour it over. Oh, okay, yeah. Because it is hard to scoop out of this little bag. Yeah, you can't. This is too white. You literally can't see it. It is what it is. Did you get some gloves? I did try to buy some. I'm not going to buy them there. I'm gonna. I think I'm going to go to Lottie World probably today and buy some. Yeah. I was. They had some gloves that were uh, one for six dollars or two for ten, but they were like, that. She was like pointing at the female and she's like female. I was like, I don't. I don't care with the male ones because I don't really don't think the females would fit me either. They're like super super thin and they're all like hot pink. So I was like, ah, I'm not really yeah. vibing. I'm not. <laughs> Like I love pop, I love pink, but like that's not really my vibe anymore. So I'm like, I'm just gonna wait until like I'm gonna get the black ones. And I also want the ones that have the touch pad, so when I'm filming, you know, I can actually film. Teaspoon of salt. Teaspoon of salt. So that's like these, like our. Uh, that's not salt. Oh, I was like, what are you doing? Just sprinkle some in it. Oh. You don't have to measure it. I'll measure it though. But yeah, that market. It was awesome. I definitely want to go there and well, there's this stand in the middle that looked like they sold like traditional Korean um, wood making stuff, but it was just so expensive. I was yeah. like, man, this looks like stuff I could probably get somewhere cheaper. All right, two tablespoons of olive oil. Two tablespoons. We should add a little bit more. Yeah. That it too? helps it fry when it's in the pan. Yeah. Let's just do what three? No. Two and a half. Do like two in a, in a splash. Oh, okay. That was okay, this pretty is much a, two and a half. <laughs> that's like when you're watching TV shows and they're like, just a little bit of wine. <laughs> the whole bottle <laughs> goes in. <laughs> How you do it? Now right. it's done. So, it? Water, so. flour, olive oil, salt, or any oil really. Salt, sugar. We already, if you're just joining, we already let our yeast sit and eat that sugar. So now we're just mixing it up. Uh, while you're here and while Erica's in limbo mixing that up, please don't forget to like the stream if you haven't already. Or it means a lot. Wherever the like button is on your phone or computer device. And if you're not or your TV. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe because we lost two subscribers. Yeah, the and bots. The <laughs> we know that they're probably just bots and not real people because that happens all the time. You get like people that like Watch my sex show and comment on it and then subscribe. So. But it still hurts Erica's feelings. It does. Because this is my this is my self-worth. Oh, I wanted to update you all. So, I had my free class this week. The one that I was telling you about last week. Yeah, it was it's terrible. I'm going to be honest. Uh, I teach all levels of students. So, it's really, really hard. Because some of my students have never had English class in their lives. Um, and some of them have me in class right now, and they know at least basic, hello, how are you, okay, thank you.
So it's been a little bit of a struggle. I'm not going to lie. I've been really stressed out. So is this low carb bread? Is this the low carb bread? No. No. Yeah, fine. this is low carb bread. Yeah. Eat as much as you want. Go crazy. It will not go to your ass, I promise. I think we need more flour. More flour. We got I left the flour out for that reason. Because we added Yeah, flour. for some reason, any recipe we've well, done. I told you not to add more flour. Yeah. 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 Any recipe that we've done always requires us to add more flour. I don't know why the dough is too sticky. And it says, you know, it should be sticky, but you should be able well, to work with it. I know why this bread is sticky. It's because I added too much oil. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm going to plop this out. Uh, like I said, we do not have... Here, I'll sprinkle some. Roll this out, and then we add oil to the table. It's fine. You can see it. Good. We washed the table, so we're good. Yeah. All right. Make sure you're working with a clean surface. Boom. Boom. Look at that dough. You can't really see the dough because it's it's washed. Yeah. <laughs> Here, let me fuck with the light. It's already on warm, so I doubt it's going to work. Let me just turn it off. Let me just try something. I don't out. think that's going to be. You can try it out. Nah. Does that make it look any no, better? No, it just makes us look more dull. Damn. Wow. Wow. But yeah, this white blob that Erica's working with is bread dough. <laughs> you can use this dough for literally anything. Uh, we pizza, have. dip, sandwiches, whatever you want to make, it's good for. You guys gotten any word on your package? No. Nope. Every Not morning, it. first thing we do, package, package. Yeah, we, we still check outside the door at least twice a day and nothing. So. All right. I don't know. You want to need it some? Yeah, here. I think it's good, but you can eat it some. Maybe add some more flour to the surface. Just here, move some of that in there. That's that's the worst part, though, when you get the chunks of dough. That's like just a chunk of flour. This is, I like uh, making bread. It's relaxing to me. Yeah, there's something about kneading the dough that's just it's, it's therapeutic. It's, it's relaxing because, like, I love cooking normally, but like there's so many factors that could go, it could go, it could, this can go more wrong, but like I just follow a strict recipe and that's it. Yeah. The cooking, I'm just like, oh, you know, I'm in more control, so it's like more stressful. This is just like, I follow one recipe and that's all I can do. I can't do any more. I can't do any less. That's it. So it's pretty relaxing. Like I had no control in it, basically. And I always beat the shit out of it and Erica don't like that. I don't care. Oh, I want to show. Oh, I have flour all in here. I want to show them Same. some of those noodles. Yeah, show, show the noodles that we got at the... Here, here's just one. Yeah. So here's... Boom. That's what our Indonesian oh, look at noodles are we found. Is it Pogate? Boom. I have no clue what flavor this is, but everything's vegan. It's artificial flavor, that's why. But... I think we need a little more flour on yeah, it. Yeah. Okay. A bit sticky. I definitely think they translated the calories wrong because on those, there were like 80 calories, and those are fried noodles. Yeah, you ever had ramen noodles that are 80 calories? Especially the fried kind. Like, okay, I see you. Yeah. Guess I can eat 12 of them. Yeah. All right. Are we good? You want to... Just a little sticky, but that's okay. You want to so, add more? No. I think we should get it. I'm gonna clean this off and add oil. That's what I did last time. Yeah, well let's, before we do that, let's get it into a nice circle. I think this is the best way to make an even bread. Get it into a circle and then we'll we'll cut it into fours. Okay. That sound good? Yeah. Uh, no, I don't have it over here. I'm gonna so do. we have this, this whole dough here. We're gonna make four breads out of it. Are we only four? Yeah. This is only, you doubled yours last time. You no, did. I know, but I made like 12. Because I, I make them thinner. Well, you want to do six? Yeah. Let's do All right, we'll do six. Because I don't want them super thick. I want them like. Yeah, these will, yeah. So we'll do six breads out of this. So we'll do one, we'll make an X first. I love the way dough cuts. Oh my God. So satisfying. Whoever just, you know, I'm going to put some yeast in my dough. What do you Whoever invented bread, 
did oh, good. Okay. It's crazy to me how this stuff was discovered. I, I don't know how. Maybe it's just like it naturally. Oh, maybe that's bacteria naturally formed and that's how. Yeah, someone just left some whatever out and then boom. So, and gave it some sugar and was like that. It's all boom. Like all my Donkey Kong. Okay. All right, there's six fairly even loaves. I'm going to put these to the side so we can clean up our prep surface. And we're going to put oil down so that there, we don't have to keep adding oil to the pan a lot. I mean, we're still going to add some, but it's just easier when you're making pan fried bread to do this. All right, I'm going to clean up a little bit. Uh, my... This is the shitty thing about live streams is that you have to see everything, so you have to see us clean. You, usually we would just cut. We'll just cut around this in a video. But you see it all. But you get that raw experience. So how is everybody? How's the weather? I heard it's getting cold again. How's that going? At least in the States. You guys are probably about to get our cold. My dad said that uh, he looked on the weather forecast and you guys are about to get the negative temperatures that we've had recently. So good luck. It sucked. Have fun. As you can tell, we're both really pooped and tired. Uh, we walked like 15,000 steps yesterday, which is like, what, seven miles? It was like seven miles. So we're like both really tired and pooped and I'm just ready to sleep more. I can't. I'm going to just... All right, just I'm gonna a, put, just a touch. No, I'm going to put a good amount. Well, well, just a little bit for one. We'll do one at a time. Okay, that's good. You didn't watch me make it last time. Yeah, that's how it was, and you said it was really good. Okay, now I'm putting it in the oil. Okay, do you want to get the pan hot? I'm, yeah. Uh, are we moving in or no? Camera. No. Because I can just do this, and you can do that. Yeah. Okay. We won't move the no camera. Pan. Yeah, we won't move the camera this time. Uh... It's a pretty quick process as far as like the cooking goes, but it's literally like, hmm, what could we compare it pancakes. to? Pancakes. It's like a pancake, yeah. yeah. You lay it down, let the one side cook, flip it, let it cook. Once it's brown on both sides, you're good to go. We are frying grandma's on the mend. That's good. Grandma's, that. grandma's on the mend? Yeah. Good. That's, more That's awesome. We wish nothing but the best. Hopefully not too much longer. She'd back up to her strength. Oh, okay. This one. Don't make fun of my cup. Okay, this is... You ready? Yep, it's ready. Well, do you want to... Let that get a little hotter. Yeah, we'll let the pan get a little hotter, then we'll throw this bad boy in. Should be pretty good. I mean, it has enough oil, so... Anything with enough oil is good. That's what we always say. We're always watching these cooking shows, and people use just loads of oil. I'm like... That's why your food is good. We always say, like, we want to see somebody who's good at cooking without all the oil and without all the fat. Like, yeah. I want to see healthy, good food, you know? There's all these chefs that have Michelin stars or whatever. But, like, obviously your food's going to be good when you're dumping all this, yeah. like, just naturally good stuff on it, like oil and shit. Like, it's not healthy. It might taste good, but it's not healthy, which, you know. But I guess that's where the ingredients are key and, like, you know. If you use good oil, it's going to be even better, you know? Yeah. I want someone to get a Michelin star for a restaurant that just serves, like, healthy food, yeah. like, low-carb, low-oil, all that good stuff. I'm sure there's somewhere. Somewhere probably has one. Yeah. Try all to right. make flavor out of that. You want to try to be careful. All right. Here's it's the transfer. Weird. This is the most important process. Ooh. Oh, it's thin. Do you want to re-roll it? Not here. Oh, that sorry. one was a little too thin, probably. Okay. All right, that one was thin. This one might. You want to fix it or? No. Oh, it's okay. We can have a hole in the bread. This one might be too thin. This one I won't make as thin. I'm sorry. My bad. This, the first one I'll always, when I make, is a flop anyway, to be honest. I'm going to be real. This first piece of bread looks like Africa. <laughs> That's just how it came out on the pan. Rainstorm. We just watched the whole series of, uh, what's it called? Madagascar. <laughs> we watched all three Madagascar movies the last couple of days. I didn't know there was a third one. Just so you know, there's a third one. Uh, there, it's on Korean Netflix. I don't know if it's on uh, the States Netflix, but it's on Korean Netflix. It's pretty good. It's it's where that um, 
that gif, if you've seen it, it's like, what is it? Uh, Afro. Afro Circus. Af that thing. I've always heard it. I just didn't know that was. Okay, this one's much better. Not as thin. But yeah, I, I didn't know where it was from. I, thought, I don't know. I just thought it was from like one of the TV shows, one of the shorts. Because, you know, that they made freaking, what, Penguins of Madagascar. And they yeah. probably made seven other things. I don't know. Yeah. Is this good? Yeah, that one looks good. I think it'll be good. How's that one looking? Or yeah, good. this one's too thin. Flat, flop. Oh, well, we'll eat it. We'll eat that one right now. We always yeah, eat Yeah, we always eat one. one. We always eat the first one because it's always the worst. That's a, that's a good thing about cooking is when you are the cook, you can eat whatever you want. Yeah. You can lick the spoon when you bake. You can eat the fuck-ups. Win-win. I'm covered in flour. I'm not as bad. I think you got more... More from opening it. For sure. My mom, when I was little, she told me that um, one time I went to the bathroom and I locked myself in there and I completely covered myself in baby powder. She walked in and she's like, oh my God, it's a fucking ghost. The whole bathroom was just covered in baby powder. I'd love to do that with flour as an adult. That'd be yeah, fun. that would be fun. <laughs> All right, I think this one's just about done. Yeah, that one's perfect. Pan fried dough, I'll tell you that. I'll tell you what that one. Pan fried dough cook fast. See, look. Yeah, this like, one's hella thin. Look, it looks like Africa. Oh. Looks good, though. Or maybe South America more. I think it's got that. that oh, it's, this is Africa, 100%, look. dude. It's just missing Madagascar. And maybe the horn. Guess I'll have to try it. Okay, let me throw it. Woo! Sorry. It's probably hot. I just pulled it off. <laughs> mm. So these are on par with tortillas, but they're much easier to make than tortillas. And they don't have to be as thin. Mm. I love bread. Oh my god. So good. Alright, that one laid a lot easier. That's really good, baby. Let me try it. <laughs> Nothing mm. like fresh homemade bread, dude. Especially when you bake it, but yeah, this is the next best thing. It's very similar to a pizza crust, mm. you know. We might, in the future, try to tweak this recipe a little bit to get something that's like, I don't know, closely related to oven baked white bread. How? Um, How would we be able to do that? I don't know. The first one always struggles to rise too. Like, these ones aren't rising as much. Yeah, these are not rising as much. I don't know. We didn't let... Because we were filming, we didn't let it sit that long, though. No. Yeah, usually we let the le the yeast sit maybe 15 minutes at least, but... Oh, well. Still freaking good. Mm -hmm. We're gonna... That's the job. After we cook these two, we're gonna make some, uh, like, garlic butter and try it with a couple different things, like garlic butter, a little bit of olive oil. We don't even have olive oil. A little bit of sunflower oil. <laughs> sesame oil. Oh, really? You put sesame oil on everything. I put that shit on everything. Like, Frank's <laughs> Red Hot. I oh, my God. You know what I would do? Anyone out there, please go buy and eat this for me. Go eat. Go buy Snyder's. What is it? Hot buffalo wing pretzels. Oh Pretzel my god, nugget. please go buy those and eat those for me. And just tell Erica how they taste and she'll Are they crazy. super hot still or are they like kind of creamy? Pangea? <laughs> it looks like the super continent of Pangea. <laughs> just don't know about Pangea. They don't know about Pangea. <laughs> Alright, that's one good. I'll see y'all. Now we're here. Um, this, you know, it kind of, kind of tastes like grilled cheese to me for some reason. What? <laughs> Maybe because I'm dreaming of fucking grilled cheese. Mm. Oh, I'm going to tell you guys. It is kind of creamy. Uh, it is kind of creamy. Uh, there's a new vegan brand in Korea, and they actually label stuff vegan. And we actually just did a review on one of the items. It'll be up Monday. But yeah. um, it actually, like in the convenience store, I can go to most of the convenience stores, and it says vegan plant-based and it's uh like the tofu that we made last week it's like that and then there's like a it's like a beef flavored one kind of and they have that yeah. and i'm super excited and i guess apparently they're coming out with uh like actual meat like vegan meat for the super or the for the convenience store and cheese 
Tease! Oh my god, you have no no clue. Here, I'll show. Oh! <laughs> oh, on that flip. Oh, that one had a big bubble. Yeah, that one had a bubble on it. Yeah, that's what it's supposed to have bubbles, but like, yeast, make your yeast set long enough. Yeah. But I don't care. This is just fine. It's really more for just texture. Like a lighter, a lighter texture because the yeast is more airy, fluffy. Yeah. Also, cook on a lower heat. I think that helps it a little bit. Yeah, probably. Maybe it's superstition, but. But yeah, if there's a. Oh, there's a vegan cheese and vegan meat. Come on. In the States, oh my god, this cooking show would be so easy. Cook. Ooh. Oh, that's a lot. I am. I'm going to cut it. Use a big one. I'll cut it. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> uh, yeah, in the States it would be super easy. Or in like uh, Europe or something because they have so much vegan, op so many vegan options and meat everywhere. And it's, I mean, I know there's still areas in the States that are lacking accessibility, but like when I first went vegan, there was like no, there was like one brand of vegan meat you could find at one store. And now, oh my God, there's every store, almost every restaurant has something. I remember when I first went vegan, the only thing I could get it was then I went to Denny's and they had a veggie burger and that's it. And that was only what, three years ago? Was it three or four? Yeah, three years ago. Three years so, ago? Yeah. Ooh, watch out. Don't want oh. Don't want it in my oh my bread. My bread. Okay, I don't know about you guys, but there's always when I make dough, there's always like a black spot in a piece of dough. I don't know what it is. It's it has to be like paint from the table or something, always, but no matter where. When I made bread, there's always like a spot. Yeah, a little speck. Like, I don't care, I'm eating it. We'll eat anything. This one, I mean, I haven't had one yet, but I'm sure there's gonna be one. Does this look good or thinner? No, nope, that's perfect. But yeah, we hope your package comes soon. So we wanna do a, an opening video on it. Uh, Marie sent us a package too, and we're waiting on that. But in time, we'll wait. Yeah, Marie, it's are you tracking that package? Let us know. Let us know where it's at. Oh, there it is. It's weird though because last time you sent a package, we got it in a week. So I don't know if there's the holidays maybe, or I don't know. They changed. Oh, this one is a little longer. You want? You want it? Well, the outside is doughy. Flower. I'm just covered. I'm just. I am flower. I have become one with the flower. There was somebody um, who was, we're part of this, it's called Langland Exchange for a bar uh -huh. downtown. And there was some guy messaging me, uh, trying to meet up with me. I was like, oh, me and my husband could. He's like, oh, you're married? I'm like, damn right. Why is it just assume that I'm single, the weirdo? And I'm then he, basically the conversation you continue is where I'm like, oh, are you buy my friend. My friend is in the States or is in Korea and he, you know, would be interested. He's like, no, I like girls. And then the whole progression of basically, please find me an American girl. Please, please, please. I'm like, well, I don't know any in Korea. He's like, well, try, please, please, please. And then he, again, he's like, well, meet me. And I'm like, no, I'm married. Leave me alone. We should do a taste test of these. Yeah. Why? Just because you want to eat them? Yep. Taste test. How is side? Oh, you want to see? Here, I won't do this. Though. I'll show side. I will show my son. Siler! Siler James! Come here! You good? Yeah, I was cleaning out the pan. I was cleaning out the pan. Alright, next one drop. Come here, Sai. Don't freak people right away. Sai is not having it. All right, I got him. Hurry! Hey, Sai! Baby! Say hi! Say hi to him. <laughs> Don't hold him like that. Of course he's gonna run away. He, he already did not want to be on camera. He he's like, I know what's camera. coming. And I'm not here for it. But that's how Sai is. Yeah. <laughs> he, uh, I got a heating pad for Christmas. So he got a heating pad for Christmas. So he's happy. He, he, he just loves sits on it, it. all he, day, all day, on or off. It's his thing. Yeah. Plus, I think it has this texture that like feels like beads. 
you know, the heating mm -hmm. beads. That's not really smart. But, uh, yeah, he has x-ray vision for that thing. If we have it under my left leg, he lays on top of my left leg because he just knows. Yeah. He's like, I'm going to get that heating pie, whether you like it or not. But he's just like his mommy in that sense because I love it too. So what do you want to wanna, what do you want to see next week? Uh, I really want to make some type of dessert. My mom recommended us to do breakfast, but like we're gonna make pancakes. Is that it? Like that's basically this. Well, we and also another thing we were thinking about making this week, but we decided we couldn't just because we didn't know this until this morning. But uh, we were gonna make something called hot talk, which is like a Korean pancake. Basically, it's like a puffy pancake. And it's filled with. And it has like yeah, it has filling in it. But you have to let you have to let it sit for like forty five minutes to an hour uh, during the cooking process. So with the yeast. Yeah. So <laughs> is that something? <coughs> well, we can prep the yeah, yeast. Yeah, I was gonna <laughs> say if we do hot talk, is that something? Would you you would like to see if we prep the yeast and just cook? You know, show you guys everything after that. Uh, it, I think it'd be pretty interesting. It's another Korean dish. The Korean dishes seem to be more popular. It's a uh, very um. Winter, like that's when they sell it. Is winter? It's like you go get some coffee and a hot talk on the side of the road. It's like a, it's a it's a street food. Yeah. You as soon as it hit cold here, like that was all I saw. Like we have one right outside of our house, but we yeah. we have never had it because it's it has does it? Actually, it usually has like milk in it. Milk, yeah, but it doesn't have egg. Yeah. It uses um that interesting thing is is because it, it uses flour and rice flour. Which makes the flour mix it fluffy, but then the, the rice flour makes it chewy. Yeah. Which is like such a good combination, I think. It'd be really interesting for us to try making. Yeah. So if you don't mind us prepping beforehand or the night before, probably, I don't know. Yeah. Or we could just do it on camera and it'll just be a long stream and it'll be over it'll probably <laughs> it'll be over an hour. Crap? No. Crepes or muffins? Uh I'll show you a picture. Oh, oh you want us to make saying, yeah. oh. Muffins would be hard. No, we don't uh, have the oven. We could do crepes. Crepes are just pancakes, basically. Yeah, we could really try. Good. We actually have a decent pan that would be good for the crepes. We, uh, we definitely have to buy a rolling pin then, 100%. Yeah, then we'll have to get them real thin. Mm -hmm. Or well, or crepes, you pour, right? Yeah, but, oh. You just you? pour yeah. a thin layer and they fry, I think. Oh, yeah, you do, actually. Now that I think about it. Yeah, we could do crepes. I would make crepes. That would be cool. We'd probably just set up the camera up there the whole time then. Or move it. Yeah. Yeah, crepes would be an interesting one, actually. Yeah, and then we can roll them and fill them with different things, like fruit. Yeah. And I, peanut butter. I would, I would love doing that. We that could do crepes next fun. week. Or should we do, like, an actual savory dish next week? I don't know. We I can do crepes next week. I don't care. But, yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, that's a good recommendation. So we just want to get some ideas built so we have, you know, some good things to make for the next couple weeks. If not, I'm doing a puzzle. If no one comes up with ideas, Erica will do a puzzle I'm for an hour. I'm doing a puzzle. We could do a puzzle together and you could tell me. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Woo! Looking good. Oh, my God. Looking good. Can you this ditch one's a little puffier. Ditch oven on your. Can you ditch oven on your stove top? I don't know, I don't that know what that is. Is that like uh, some type of. I don't know. Oh, Dutch oven? Dutch oven. Oh, I mean, we don't have a Dutch oven, but we, I don't, I've never seen one in Korea. That, I mean, yeah, I, I think, yeah, you were saying something like that, I think last week, but we would like to, but a Dutch oven would be expensive. Also, I've never seen something like that in Korea, ever. I've seen cast iron pans, but not Dutch oven. No, I haven't really seen, I haven't even seen a big pot. Like, I wanted to buy a soup pot, or not a pot, yeah, it's a pot. A soup pot, but I've never seen a big one. They had the they had them at the market yesterday. I saw them. Oh, you did? Yeah. Yeah, we probably have one footage. Yeah, like our local store, they they don't have it. Yeah. Because I guess those are probably sold to restaurants. Yeah, they probably just buy them direct. Yeah. Dutch, yeah, he's Dutch. Dutch oven, yeah. I got you. Just cooking no wet, baking some bread on the stove top. All you need is a lid. Oh, yeah. then we have, well, we have a lid for that. Can we that Dutch mean, oven it? I mean. Can we Dutch oven that with a lid? We have a lid. Yeah, we have a, for, for this thing. 
Kind of it's, a, it's like a walk, you know, it's, it's deep enough. Yeah, it's. You can't put coals on the top, though. It ain't a real Dutch oven. Our Dutch oven's even Dutch. We could, uh, when it gets warm out, we could go find somewhere and start. That's the thing, you can't even have a fire in Korea. Like, yeah. I was about to say we can go have a fire and, like, cook on a fire, but, like, we can't even do that in Korea. Yeah, you're not supposed to do fires out because forest fires are yeah. a, an issue in our area. Is, are they? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we they have signs up. Sign, yeah. Yeah. They have these big banners around the forest that, like, the hiking trails that say don't start a fire when you go in. Yeah, we went one time, and, like, when we first got here, when it was just not too cold, and we saw those. Good, yeah, okay. Well, All we right. Can, we can look it up, then. Yeah, if we can if we can do something like that, we will definitely try it. That would be a lot of fun to try something unconventional like that. Oh, yeah. That's what we're all about. I want to do uh, mug cookies one time, but, like, we should do a, an episode of just a few of those microwave cooking things because they're, they're really fast, so I want to make it, like, an hour, but the microwave crap is super fast. Yeah. Because it's freaking, what is it? Micro speed. No, no, not micro speed. That's the one, what? The Excel speed, I don't know. I don't um, know the word I'm looking for. Do you want to save it so we can do dipping sauces? No. Here, I'll, uh, we can get yeah, gar gonna start real garlic it. or powdered garlic? Get some real garlic and garlic powder. I'm going to get garlic powder. We'll just make that. Oh, get the... Here some boutier. Hey, I'm going to get some pizza sauce. Yeah, get some pizza sauce. So we're going to make our dipping sauces. Well, sauce probably. Just oil and oil and garlic. Oh, here. Sorry. Actually, here, I'll cut up this garlic. we got to use that garlic. Yeah, I know. Well, this is the perfect thing. We'll get like five of them. Yeah. I got six. That works. Six, that works. This is the pizza sauce you can buy in Korea. Yeah, it's weird. Weird looking. It's really like vinegary and not that good, but it's what you get. This one? Come on, focus. Focus! Okay, well, that's enough. Boom, beautiful. Beautiful. Well, a fall. Too bad about fire. So you can make oven with tin foil and cardboard. You can make a. We can make what? Camp oven with foil and cardboard. Foil and cardboard, yeah. That'd be interesting. Oh, we're not in focus. We're good. This actually, underneath of this, it says like, subscribe, share, but, you know. Yeah, so tomorrow, uh, that review on those uh, vegan convenience store things are going out it's it's not like our normal convenience store one it's just like a review and and like us eating it basically yeah because it's just one item <laughs> well it's two items but one like one item but two flavors <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah yeah there i got it out sorry i'm cutting this weird you want a knife to help me yeah we're we just gonna use the table yeah we have cutting boards but the table works Tables also wood. I mean, yeah, basically one giant cutting board. It. I don't. It's not like actually wood though. Faux wood. It's like yeah, it's big for sure. What's up? I love to watch you guys, but I'm tired. Good night. I hope we write again on Snapchat or whatever. Good night, yeah. Marie. Good night, Marie. Thank you for coming. We love having you here. Yeah, you're amazing. Sleep well. Have a good day of school tomorrow. No. Good night. It's Friday for her. Or Saturday. Have a good day tomorrow. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Man. So, in Korea... Um, you hang dry your clothes. That's just like the norm. And right now it's winter, so obviously it's very moist in our house. And I looked behind, like, I noticed that, well, David noticed that we have some mold going on. And I asked my boss, and she's like, oh, that's common. You know, you got to you gotta open your windows and air it out all the time. I'm like, 
So it's zero degrees out, but I'm supposed to open my windows because you guys have really bad ventilation. So I'm like struggling with what to do because we already have the mold. So I'm not sure. Like she's like, I'll, I'll contact the landlord. I'm like, I'm not really sure what to do, but it's so shitty. Like our windows are completely like the, the, the sliding part. Yeah. They get filled with water. Completely filled with water just because all the condensation and moisture in the air. It it's so bad. Like there's just water everywhere. And like, it's not just us. Like that's just an issue in Korea. Like Austin, Austin, our friend that also lives in Korea, he has the same issue. I'm like, this is such a bad design. Like I don't know how we fix that in the states, but we do not have that problem. I think we just have better ventilation. Oh, I, was like, oh, I forgot about that. Mine, it was there. I was just letting it cook through. Yeah, I'll show the prettier side. All right, done with that. All right. So those are our breads. They're nice up? and cooked. Good. Woo! Fucking hot. All right. I just put uh, garlic, oil. Do you want to mix oil or do you want butter? Butter, yeah. Cut butter. some butter in there. I'll heat it up. Oh, God. I love garlic. It smells so good. We love fresh garlic. We put it in everything. Yeah. So I think most people just love garlic. It's just like an unanimous, a unanimous thing. Then why do people hate garlic breath so much? Why does it get so much hate? Because it stinks. There's a difference. Mm-hmm. Are you going to just put this in the microwave? Yeah. Okay. Is that enough? A little more. I'd actually good do more. Maybe like one little bar. Really? No, this We're not going to I'm not going to eat all that, so. All right, I'm going to show them beforehand. This is before. Actually, I'm gonna add garlic powder too, because the garlic doesn't doesn't like mix in with the butter. <laughs> they just landed on me. I'm just God, throwing garlic on her. There you go. All right, I'm gonna heat that up real quick. The rain. I'm going to not heat it up too long that the butter explodes in the microwave this time. Wow, really? You've never done that. <laughs> I'm going to try something new today. These are looking good though. Oh, I cannot wait to eat one. Okay, I kind of ate one already, kind of. We, we, we ate, ate pieces, one together. but that doesn't count. Didn't have sauce. I'm gonna eat mine with pizza sauce, I think. Well, I'm gonna use pizza sauce and garlic butter. Ooh, okay. This is why we're fat. This is why. This is why. This is why we're fat. Okay, I'm just gonna stir this yeah. up a little bit. Need the dough for another minute. I really don't know anyone in my life that would not chow these down in a heartbeat. Yeah, so. these are insanely good. I know they just look like tortillas or whatever, but you know they're beautiful. They're, they're bready on the inside. They're, yeah, they're, they're thicker. Oh, oh. Can I show? I might. Here, move your head. Don't no, don't. Is it in focus? No. Is it in focus oh, now? Oh yeah. It's kind of in focus. Yeah, there you go. You get the ideas. All right. So we got our, I don't know, kind of washed out, but if we got garlic butter it. there. It's okay. You want to mix it up? Yeah, I'll mix that up. Oh my God, it smells so good though. Oh, you know what I miss from the States? I miss uh, the garlic butter from Papa John's. Oh my God, yes. That shit's vegan because it's just oil. That shit is vegan. But it's so good. All right, you ready? Do it together? Yeah, let me get a dab. All right. Cheers. Mm. Mm. I mean, that's just oil. That It will be good. And garlic. Yup. You can't go wrong. Get some chunks of garlic up on there. Give me some of that. Mm. Mm. Garlic chunks are a little spicy. 
Bread looks delicious. Oh, yeah. oh my god, it is it's so good. Mm -hmm. We get some pizza sauce mm -hmm. out on here. We are avid bread eaters, so the fact that we can make bread without an oven is essential to us. Yeah. Mm. Are you ready for the combo? No. Scoop some garlic. Ooh. <laughs> There's the combo. Garlic and pizza sauce. And garlic on your laptop. Yep. Mm. Oh, something Rowan said something. <laughs> no. I'm not tutoring right now. I'm getting tutoring notification. Rowan does cheers too. <laughs> <laughs> cheers. I miss Rowan. I miss my babies. I might try to call them. Mm. I mean, this is so good. Yeah, we can just sit here. Yeah, I could just eat the rest of this right now. <laughs> I mean, we will. We this will. will be gone today. Yeah, we'll eat all this bread today. It's Sunday. We can get fat today. We were good yesterday. We were gone all day long, and we didn't even go out to eat. Yeah, that's impressive. We're trying. We're trying to. Work on a budget this month, so we kind of know how much we're spending while we're in Korea. Mm -hmm. So, because we we're trying to set a goal to save a bunch of money while we're here. Bunch. Erica thinks we're poor. We are poor. But so you know, we're trying our best to be frugal. If you always have the mentality that you're poor, that means you'll be rich in the future. Because then you save all your money. Yeah. And then you'll be rich. Like my well, my dad's not rich, but he saved all his money and he got all his shit out of the trash. And he has money now. And boom. That's why I'm like, I will never buy new furniture. <laughs> Tammy says true. The all the furniture that we have here that from us is all from the trash. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Every my my chair is from the trash. We have shelves from the trash. Our desk. We just take it in, clean the hell out of it, and then boom. I know. See, he's laughing because he knows it's true. Is Dobby watching? Hi, Dobberton. Hi, Dobby D. I love you. Dobby's my cat. We miss our animals. Mm, but. We miss our animals more than humans. <laughs> Sorry, guys, but no. <laughs> They're nicer. Mm. It's so good. It's like eating a pizza when you dip the two together. Mm. It's like I used to dip my pizza in America, like in the garlic butter. Uh, we've been making pizza with this type of bread, and then we just, there's like no pizza topping, so we decided to... Fried mushroom, garlic, onion, and tofu, and peppers, and it's actually really good. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we probably, the, the best part is the uh, Korean green chilies. Mm, yeah. Oh, those go so good on a pizza topping. Yeah. It's like and, a hot pepper. And the mushrooms here, I don't know what type of mushrooms we get, but they're so free. They're way better than, like, the mushrooms in the States. Yeah, I, I never liked eating mushrooms in the States, but I love eating them here. Mm -hmm. They're like this big and they're just fat. They're so good. Mm. Did you finish it? Yeah. I want more. Make more. Should I? If you want it. It's a bad idea. I'm about to be done. Yeah. This I is. Only... Oh, sorry. Yeah. I can only eat so much in the morning. I can eat forever. Always, no matter what time. This is like, I know traditional American food is like always sweet. Like breakfast food, like pancakes, but if you don't care about what's for breakfast, this is a good breakfast food. Mm -hmm. mm. I don't care what I eat for breakfast. We just care that we eat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I usually like to eat fruit somehow. Yesterday we, from our no-bake recipe, we made the rest of those oats with um, banana. Oh, yeah. But, man, those oats just get so soft. And like, if you... Any water added to them, and they're just like, Whoa. even I didn't even microwave mine, they just crumble. All right, well, I think I'm good. I'm pretty good. 
You want to end it? Yeah, let's call it on that. All right. Well, we really appreciate you watching if you're still watching. I have three girl cheese. Oh, pickles? Put pickles on them, Mom. Uh, I would love to. Girl cheese with pickles. So good. I'm jealous. I miss You're cheese. eating three? You never eat three, Mom. That's crazy. Hey, but then you're, you're with us on the bread. We're going to end it here. Uh, I hope you enjoyed us making this pan fried bread. We definitely enjoyed it, and we clearly ate over half of what yeah. we made. So <laughs> it was definitely uh, a lot of fun to make. We love making this bread. Yeah. We love making any kind of food for you guys. Thank you all for watching. Yeah. Uh, if you haven't already, obviously, please like and subscribe if you aren't. And uh, we'll see you guys next week when we make some sort of dessert. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we don't know what we're making next week, but we'll, we'll figure we'll it out. We'll know Sunday morning yeah. what we're making. Yeah, so. That's usually what happens. Uh, like you said, we, we're happy that you stayed here. We appreciate you. We love you. Uh, can't wait to see you next week. Three videos coming this week. Stay tuned, and we'll see you guys next week. All bye. Right, bye.